I'm recording this just before Christmas 2018, and I just got word of Donald Trump's uh, bump stock ban. So here's the hilarious thing. I'm, I'm not a political kind of person. I don't vote. I don't I enc actually I encourage other people not to vote. And I have good reasons for it. I'll tell you more about that later. But there were a lot of people that I knew in the gun world that thought Donald Trump, you know, you can't let Hillary in because she's going to make guns illegal and she's going to make laws and oh, you know how the Clintons were with executive orders. And at least Donald Trump's just, you know, he's at least he's going to be pro gun and gun friendly. And he's pretty libertarian leaning. <laughs> of course, I didn't buy into any of this, but I actually did kind of think there was a greater chance that Hillary would uh, violate the, the government's uh, constitution, their, their second amendment of it. And I thought she would be the one that would be more likely to do it. And then uh, here Donald Trump is uh, doing an executive order, I understand, of some sort, uh, or some sort of, you know, legal finagling uh, to make bump stocks illegal. And I don't like bump stocks. I mean, it's not something I choose to have on my guns. Um, they're kind of weird and strange, but a completely wrong premise for making him illegal. Just a completely moronic, stupid decision. And uh, hilarious, because you know that the people who wanted him to make this choice aren't going to give him any love for it. Oh, it's too late. He did it too late. He should have done it before Las Vegas or whatever. The whole thing is so ridiculous. But those of you that thought Trump was going to be different, he's not like the establishment. He's not going to roll over. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? Ha, 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 ha.